Yeah, just tell us uh, why you would want to be Reggie Redbird. Oh, it sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs> Try something new, get on the field and kind of party a little bit. Uh, really Team Reggie tryouts are um, open to any ISU student. Obviously, they have to be fully enrolled in class. And we open it up to anyone, it doesn't matter. Guys, girls, doesn't matter height. At the tryouts, we just have them come in, we interview them, get to know them um, pretty well. So we feel like if they could fit in with our team, and then we have them get in the suit, and then we have them um, do different things that Reggie would do, obviously crowd pump up, dance around, and then we have them work with props, like ride around on a tricycle and stuff like that. And you really have to be expressive in that. That's kind of what we're looking for when people try out and see if they could kind of fit that and adapt. Next thing we're gonna have you do is uh, just dance around. We're gonna play some music, listen to it, okay. and then uh, you can listen to it for like five seconds and then kind of just throw down some dance moves that you think would go well with it. I think it's also just being, being Reggie, kind of, kind of, oh, that person is a little goofy and they really fit well, they would fit well with the team. Um, when people see Reggie, they're excited. And I think that's a big part of being Reggie and having a good day as Reggie, is you're encouraging people just um, in the stance and then also just um, making people's day and making them happy. Obviously kids, fans, or anyone just around campus that we'll see. Ryan is the coordinator for Team Reggie, so he's our staff member that is our primary point person for, for Reggie, all of his appearances on campus, off campus. He is the person that oversees Re Reggie's email. He works with Reggie's social media accounts, Twitter and Facebook, Instagram. Um, and Reggie oftentimes is escorted by Ryan primarily to events. So if you see Reggie around, Ryan's probably not too far behind. Making sure he's He's, he's okay out there in the hot weather and stuff like that. And also no kids are punching him in the head or anything like that as well. Reggie has morphed into so much more than just a mascot at, at games. He is now literally at the face of the, of the university and he's not just a symbol for athletics, but he is also a symbol for RSOs on campus. He's a symbol for um, relationship building. And then with the explosion of social media, it has allowed us to develop Reggie's personality so much more than before. Reggie can now interact and joke with people in a way that he couldn't previously because Reggie doesn't actually talk, but he can communicate through his Twitter account. If you haven't followed him, you should. Just being a part of Team Reggie and Red Bear Pride has uh, really been a big thing for me because I really get into the games. I, I love every sport that I go to, and Reggie always gets the crowd pumped up and kind of brings you over the edge, kind of. You're just a fan, you know, you're cheering them on, but when you see Reggie there, you really want to just get pumped up and cheer on the Redbirds to victory. State your passion. State your passion at Illinois State University.